My name is Brian Park. I'm the master of channel. I am reporting from 2046 of June 5th, Monday. Today, Apple announced the big things. iOS 17, tvOS, watchOS, macOS, Sonoma, lots of things. However, the number one product that grabbed my attention the most was of course the Vision Pro. I uploaded this video of my lab safety glass on the Twitter and somehow it got lots of views, lots of likes. I think this tweet has been the most liked and watched video of my tweeting lifetime. So yeah, Vision Pro. I was watching this Vision Pro live and it's just crazy. $3,500. It wasn't really a surprise at all because Apple is going to announce this new product of the VR era of their ecosystem. And of course, the price is going to be high. Remember the Samsung unveiled the Galaxy Z Fold 1? The price was immense fucking expensive lots of technology is involved in their product and i think that goes same to apple vision pro lots of cameras lots of sensors two chips a lot of things apple vision pro can do lots of things for the future the vision pro 2 is going to be a lesser price but will have more features and more upgraded things and i also assume that there's gonna be vision pro 2 vision pro ultra maybe vision ultra uh, vision os 2 vision os 3 this is just the beginning of the apple ecosystem vr system ar system everything this opens the whole possibility of the metaverse you know facebook's oculus but you know if you think about the ecosystem what does facebook have just facebook app and there's no physical ecosystem otherwise the oculus however apple has everything apple has iphone ipad macbook pro apple watch adding another physical hardware system is just enlarging the ecosystem of the apple and apple is really good at managing the ecosystem a lot of developers will develop this far for the future disney ceo bob Iger was there and he was showing lots of features about how this vr goggle can put a step onto their disney world i mean you can actually be on tatooine and watch the freaking mandalorian you are there on the star wars universe and watching star wars movie as a star wars fan I would really love to try that. In the video, as the Apple showed, you can move your fingers and enlarge the TV screen. I was really surprised at the fingers too. That's what she said. <laughs> Normally, when you wear Oculus or any other VR goggles, you need another system on your hand to do other physical stuff. However, Apple just deleted that and put all the system and the cameras on the goggles cameras. And this has so much possibility. Literally, you're like, Tony Stark, you swipe it, you pull up, you zoom in, zoom out, whatever your fingers can do, it can do well on the Apple Vision Pro. And the design, I really like the design too. All glossy look, adjustable band and crown ring, it's all there. It has the Apple elastic into the Vision OS. I just want to tell you guys that this Apple Vision Pro is just the beginning, maybe in the future. They have so much apps to come out, so much possibility on this product. I think in the future, a lot of tons of or general Apple users will have this, will own this product and will just walk around with their Vision Pro on. Current Apple users will wear this product and walk around the park anywhere. It could be a wearable device when it gets developed in the future. They can literally make this as a sunglasses style. Maybe, maybe people will have AirPods on, Apple Watch on. When the AirPods came out, people talked who's going to wear these AirPods on their ears when they're walking around. Look at right now. A lot of people in my campus, every student wear the AirPods on their ear, listening to the music without thinking this is weird. It's normal life now. And in the future, I think people wearing this Vision Pro 2 or Vision Pro 5 or 10, it's going to be normal life. Let's see in 10 years if this can be the new way of communicating and the new style of wearing the wearable device. When I was watching the advertising video of the Vision Pro, I saw the white line goes to their pocket. I thought that was the iPhone. The Apple users have iPhones on their hand, on their pocket. Overall, I would give this technology 8 out of 10. If it's heavy, it could be stressful to your face and your forehead. Hi, editor Brian Park here. So according to BGR.com, written by Chris Smith, early testers told us that Vision Pro weighs about one pound. It's about 454 grams. That's just a number. The price, $3,500. I will invest more on Apple because I just think this Vision Pro is just the beginning of the VR system they are making right now. For this Vision Pro, I have the vision on Apple. 
I will keep looking forward to this Apple Vision Pro system. This was my whole opinion about the Apple's Vision Pro. That's it. Hello, thanks for watching until the end. I have to give thanks to several people. I have to give thanks to Harpreet, Randawa, Richard Artis, and Soyoung Kim. Soyoung Kim, Soyoung, of course, he has been my friend for since like 2019 and he has been commentating a lot. And so thank you, Soyoung. Richard Artis, he recently commented on my, my first car ever in my life video. Congrats, now you can travel all around Arizona and adjoining states. Told me try progressive insurance might save you some money. I really appreciate those small comments. I really respect them. Lastly, Harpeet Randawa. She is actually my friend's mom so thank you harpeet thanks for commenting to my video thanks for being honest so yeah thanks for watching this is the end yes, wake up now and not